Welcome to our Tech Collective. Today, we bring you another topic, 11 Best Affordable Motorcycle Helmets. A helmet is an essential piece of safety equipment for motorcyclists. You want suitable protection in the case of an accident to help prevent a traumatic brain injury or worse. In addition, new helmets on the market provide better protection for various activities, including daily riding, off-road adventures, and track day laps. Would you please subscribe and click the bell symbol to receive more videos before we continue? On our number 11, we have GLX GX11 Compact Lightweight. The GLX GX11 is an excellent option for searching for an inexpensive, high-quality helmet. It offers superior protection and features at a fraction of the cost of comparable models. It's also really comfortable to wear, ideal for long rides or races. On warmer days, the ventilation system performs an excellent job of keeping your head cool and dry. So, if you're searching for a good helmet at a reasonable price, the GLX GX11 is a beautiful choice. Even after hours of riding, the GX11 is exceptionally light and has no pressure spots to cause pain. The cushioning is plush and the ventilation mechanism enables plenty of air to circulate. Riding on a beautiful sunny day could get hot, so having proper ventilation to circulate the airflow will keep you riding comfortably. 10. One Storm Motorcycle Helmet One Storm helmets provide a diverse range of options in racing gear and safety equipment with dramatic, creative artwork that you'll like. Many individuals have purchased the helmets only for the stunning images etched on the top. The exterior protective shell of the One Storm helmet is super lightweight and robust. It's composed of an aerodynamic thermoplastic alloy shell technology, making it a safe choice for a safety helmet. Because it's so lovely to put on your head while driving, the mechanical skull images set it distinct from other types of safety helmets. Not only that, but the helmet is available in sizes ranging from XS to XXL. There are a variety of designs to pick from as well. Each helmet is embellished with etched motifs that radiate confidence and flair. The helmet's interiors are just as good as their exteriors. It has thick, velvety, cushioned interior cushioning that won't irritate your cheekbones or leave you gasping for air while driving at high speeds. 9. Bell Qualifier DLX Blackout The lightweight polycarbonate shell of the Qualifier DLX Blackout is comfortable and sturdy. Thanks to this function, the helmet is ideal for long joyrides and travel across rugged terrain, especially in inclement weather. Due to the use of light polycarbonate material, the toll on a biker's neck and shoulders, especially from prolonged use, is substantially minimized. The Qualifier DLX Blackout's unique design offers significant ventilation for ultimate comfort. The adjustable ventilation system allows for quicker and more efficient cooling by optimally directing airflow. The Qualifier DLX Blackout has a moisture wicking inside, making it ideal for rainy days. This will save you from having to wear a chilly wet helmet. The inside may also be removed and washed. To enhance your bike experience, Bell also includes a sculpted cheek padding, a chin curtain, and a breath deflector. The cushioned chin strap with a D-ring clasp is another noticeable comfort element. 8. Biltwell Gringo S the Biltwell Gringo S features a traditional fit and comprises an ABS polycarbonate injected molded shell with an industry-conforming EPS liner. Fit is subjective since we all have different size requirements, but the Gringo S does not have a racing feel. You may anticipate a little more space in the chin bar and a slightly less accuracy than you're used to, especially if you're utilizing high-tech race-inspired helmets. That isn't meant as criticism, but you should be mindful of what you're getting yourself into. The Gringo isn't for individuals who want to set new track marks. It's for those who wish to arrive in luxury while being suitably protected. The Gringo S is comfortable, and users will love the hand-stitched Lycra lining, which, unlike older helmets, is quite pleased. The Gringo S never boxed my ears, which is essential because I am a bispectacled rider. Even if you aren't, it's something to consider if you go for sunglasses when cruising. 7. Icon Airflight The Airflight Quicksilver Helmet's airflow is enhanced thanks to a large intake on the chin bar that directs air between the liner and the EPS foam before exiting via the back vents. 
A switch within the chin may be used to control air to the shield, your face, or seal it completely. Additional vents on the brow bring even more ventilation, making it an excellent helmet for hot weather. A washable hydrodry lining keeps items dry as well. Icon has given great attention to how air moves over the helmet and into it. At more incredible speeds, the helmet's aerodynamic shape aids to prevent strain and wind buffeting. Turning my head to monitor lanes at motorway speeds created relatively little wind resistance. The Airfly also performs admirably in terms of wind noise reduction. A simple locking tab on the chin engages when the visor is pushed down. It keeps the visor in place, but it also secures it against the rubber seal that runs the length of the viewport. It results in an excellent air seal, no wind whistles, and less overall noise inside the helmet. 6. Icon Air Mata Overall, the Air Mata is a comfy helmet with no hot spots or abnormal pressure feels. It's a bit snug to get on and off, something they've done a much better job with on the Airform, and despite the lack of grooves, we experience no unpleasant emotions wearing on ours, thick acetate glasses for that matter. It's also rather aerodynamically neutral, with no strange pulls or whistles while conducting side checks, moving from upright to tuck, full tuck, etc. This, along with the helmet, is relatively light for a full face, making it an excellent choice for extended trips. Aside from that, it has a double D-strap system, which is ideal for persons with thicker necks. This is a DOT and ECE certified helmet that receives just two stars in the sharp test, which is disappointing. Considering that the AGV K3 received four stars on the same test at the same price forces you to reconsider your priorities. 5. AGV K3 SV Mono ECE DOT Matte Black When it comes to tearing off the lid of the helmet for the first time, first impressions matter, and the K3 did not disappoint in its basic red color pattern, which is everything but. At least in the North American market, AGV appears to be uninterested in enhancing the color naming strategy. Basic Black and Mono Flat Black are about as attractive as the K3 selection gets. The watchword here must be under-promise and over-deliver in Intelligent Tactic. The rest of the globe, on the other hand, will get a K3 and a K4 in 12 distinct designs, including 5 different Valentino Rossi images. Perhaps it's a pricing issue, but we all believe that AGV would benefit from having the Rossi graphics accessible in North America, even if they're afraid that doing so will take sales away from the race helmet line. The K3 has a painted HIRTH high resistance thermoplastic resin helmet shell, according to AGV. And while it's hard to tell, the pattern on the basic red model seen above appears to be painted on rather than the cheaper deals found on many lower end helmets. The clear coat on the helmet is significantly thicker than usual, and the overall quality is excellent, with rich, brilliant colors and metallic silver paint in the stripes. 4. HJC I-90 Helmet The HJC I-90 is the testimony of how far modular helmets have progressed in the previous 10 years, with very few concessions made to keep the price low. Some riders may choose to have this helmet as a commuter helmet, but such riders would be selling it short since this is a helmet that could easily be used for cross-country rides, not just cross-city commutes. Aside from a more extended than an expected bedding in period, it's a comfortable helmet with a sturdy and trustworthy chin bar mechanism, decent ventilation and noise suppression, and it also looks great. 3. Speed and Strength SS5100 The SS5100 features a nice composite fiber shell and does an excellent job of covering all the essentials in a full face. Several vent holes, an optically perfect face shield, and a comfortable interior. It's also a fashionable design with an anti-fog coated protection and a detachable washable liner. All of Speed & Strength's helmets are now DOT and ECE Europe approved. This implies it should provide enough protection. ECE certification means it had to pass a set of closely monitored lab-based impact tests. DOT helmets on the other hand do not have to undergo required type approval testing before being sold. Two. AGV K1 Because owners say it's a goodie, the AGV K1 might be the helmet you're looking for. It's more of an entry-level sports bike helmet, 
with the Pista's appearance and appeals, but at a fraction of the price. In this instance, the K1 is constructed of less expensive materials, thermoplastic, which is simpler to shape into a helmet shell, resulting in a less expensive helmet. Surprisingly, the AGV K1 has been rated as a relatively quiet helmet for a racing-inspired helmet. Sports bike helmets are notoriously noisy since silence isn't a concern when designing a helmet that would perform well on the track. 1. Sedici Strada 2 this is a great fitting, comfortable, and lightweight helmet that is quieter than typical. It has both DOT and ECE certifications. Add in the excellent chin bar ventilation and it doesn't fog up very much or for very long, even with pen lock. You've got perhaps the most excellent helmet under $200 persistently available. That's how fantastic it is. The interior is made of smooth textured antibacterial washable nylon material with honeycomb design and little sedici writing. It feels somewhat cool to the touch and mesh on the top left and right sides of the crown liner region aid in perspiration evaporation and ventilation. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. Thank you so much for watching and do not forget to subscribe and hit the bell button.